Intel and others are looking at can they create uh, trusted uh, processing modules, TPMs and uh, trusted compute modules to do just what you say. Um, and that is to do it at the manufacturer. What I've seen in my experience is whenever anybody puts something like that in, five smart guys come by and figure out a way around it. And so with software, what they do is they figure out how the software works and calls into memory and does all these things and they inject something into the code or they do something to take over or, or they directly get your credentials, but they figure out ways to go around it. And so I think all of those are being looked at. I think you're seeing the chip manufacturers, really companies like Intel Corporation trying to do that. But the practical reality is there are so many devices being brought together that the user has to have the ability to, to come in on one device and therein lies the problem. All you have to do is look like you're that user. And so, you, you know, so I think we're gonna see Microsoft with their facial recognition, you're gonna see Bio and all these things trying to drive that down. But at the end of the day, it's a network that was built for collaboration and security is being bolted on. And you can't just replace that all. It's a $6 trillion just for the internet service provider industry. And think about all the stuff that we have. There's tremendous opportunities in this space.